The boat on display today is an awesome weight making machine. It is a 2015 Mastercraft X25 with an Ilmore 6 liter MV8 close cool 382 horsepower engine. Let's get into it and have a look. This is a gorgeous boat. It's got some nice classic coloring to it, black, white, and a silver flake. The silver flake looks awesome in the gleam of the sunshine. And on the front of the bow, you've got your bow loading ladder. So if you're pulling up to the beach, it's nice and easy to get in and out of the boat. It's got your pickle fork design, so a really nice wide bow, super spacious. These X25s are really well known for how they handle in bigger water. So if you're planning on taking it out on, on rougher, out in rougher conditions, this boat works very, very well. It's also known for putting out a really good wakeboard wake as well as surf wake. Uh, the boat is outfitted with a pair of surf tabs, which we'll get to here in a moment. It's got the 18 inch alloy blacked out wheels. It goes well with the black on the side of the boat. It's got a set of clamping swivel board racks. And then on the transom here, you've got your Gen 2 surf system. Along with your trim plate in the middle, all the underwater running gear is all in good condition. Trailer shows well. There is a bit of a uh, gal dust bleeding through the paint, but all in all, it's showing, showing well. At the transom, transom's in good condition. It's got your usual little nicks on the transom, but it does have a vinyl clear coating across the transom, so it doesn't hurt the gel. It's got your jump seats on both sides. Nice spectating spot to spectate from. Cup holders as well. The upholstery on the sun deck shows really well. It's a nice white, gray, no nicks or tears. You've got a walkthrough, nice and convenient. And while I'm staring at this tower, there's a pair of JL Audio tower speakers. Pair it up with a pair of clamping swivel Board racks. The thing that I love about Mastercrafts is Mastercrafts are really resilient to the elements. Uh, this boat is outfitted with the uh, closed cooling system, so it's outfitted to be run in salt water. But the, the thing that I really like about the Mastercrafts is they're really resilient to the salt water element. So, should you choose to uh, use your boat in salt water, upholstery in the cockpit showing really well. And this boat is well equipped. It's got the upgraded sound system with subwoofer that you can see behind the seat. You can see the heater vents in both the gunnels as well as the kick panel. Again, heater vent over in the gunnel. There's a heater vent under the dash as well for the driver. It is equipped with heated seats as well, which is a really nice bling feature. Really nice if you're gonna do some, some late season boating or winter boating admittedly here in the gold coast not essential but it is a nice feature and again i love these best of both world dashes the you've got the touch screen as well as the analog gauges so you both have buttons off the screen as well as manual switches all along the dash a bit of redundancy there which i think is really nice on a boat you can see all the CNC machine alloy on these Mastercrafts. Really adds a nice bling touch to it. In the bow, the upholstery shows really well as well. There's no nicks or tears, no stains, discoloration. It all looks pretty good. As you can see, it does have a nice big bimini as well. And now for the grunt of the boat, it is equipped with an Ilmore 6 liter MV8. It's 382 horsepower along with 411 foot pounds of torque. So it is a torque monster. It is also equipped with closed cooling. So no issues running this thing in salt water. 
And on the surface, it all looks really, really good. If you're interested in this boat, give me a call, Patrick, 0427-162-749, or you can email me at patrick at coastalboatsales.com.au.